have type 2 diabetes? You may be wondering what you can do to be as healthy as possible. Fortunately, there are many things you can do to manage your blood sugar. With type 2 diabetes, your levels of a vital hormone that aids food digestion and metabolism are lower than normal. When that hormone is low, it's hard for your body to balance your blood sugar. GLP-1 receptor agonists, also known as GLP-1-RAs, are medications that boost that hormone to do four important things. Help your body release insulin when needed. Keep your liver from releasing too much sugar into your bloodstream. Help slow food leaving your stomach, reducing blood sugar spikes. Help your brain tell your body when you're full. All four actions benefit you by reducing appetite, lowering your A1C levels, lowering risk of certain heart problems if you already have heart disease or are at high risk, helping slow kidney problems if you've developed certain complications. GLP-1-RA medications are available as daily or once weekly injectable devices or a pill. Tell your provider if you have a personal or family history of thyroid cancer, pancreatitis, gallbladder problems. If so, you should avoid GLP-1-RA medications. Common side effects with these medications include nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, constipation. The dose of GLP-1-RA medications is increased slowly over time to decrease side effects. Side effects usually subside and may stop after a few weeks. Here are some ways you can help minimize side effects. Eat more frequently with smaller, less fatty meals. Eat slowly. Stop eating at first signs of fullness. Don't lie down after eating. GLP-1-RA medications alone do not cause your blood sugar to go too low. However, if you also take insulin or certain oral diabetes medications, you need to watch for low blood sugar. When you have type 2 diabetes, you might require more or different medications over time. Research shows that using medications like GLP-1-RAs early in the course of diabetes can have lasting positive effects. GLP-1-RA medications correct many problems caused by type 2 diabetes, so they can help you reach your diabetes management goals. Ask your healthcare provider and diabetes care and education specialist if these medications fit into your treatment plan and are covered by your insurance. For more information, please visit diabeteseducator.org slash GLP-1.